kickoff against Ireland at Cardiff Arms Park. The local lads are given an extra spur in this match by the fact that it's the 75th birthday of the Welsh Rugby Union. Ireland throw in. Cliff Morgan has it for Wales. A short punt ahead goes into enemy hands for Rowe and Berkeley are there. Paddy Berkeley deals with the situation by finding a long touch. The dry, sunny day provides conditions much to the Welshman's liking, and on the whole, they look the better team, but they've yet to score. A chance comes when Owen takes a penalty for Wales. A handsome kick that gives Wales a 3-0 lead at half-time. When play resumes, Ireland get their chance, and Henderson makes no mistake with a penalty goal that equals the score. Ireland set out on an attack, playing good, forceful rugby. The sort of stuff that, if they don't tire, could sweep the Welshman to defeat. After a long spell, when Ireland are undoubtedly on top, the Welshman hit back with a vengeance. Alan Thomas cross-kicks, and teammate Courtney Meredith is after it. Mercury tries to stop him, but on goes Meredith. Owen takes the conversion kick, and Wales are well and truly in the lead by eight points to three. Minutes later, when Wales are again in the Irish 25, R.C. Thomas receives and sets off for the line. Next on the list is Robbins. Then on goes the ball to Griffiths, who dashes for the corner to touchdown. It's too wide for conversion, so 11-3 is the score, but not for long. Here goes Cliff Morgan. A superb try that makes it 14-3. Owen again steps forward and over it goes. 16-3 now, a shattering few minutes those for Ireland. But Wales haven't finished yet. Off they go again with Morris leading the attack. That try plus two more points for Owen's conversion makes it a 21-3 victory for Wales. Now if they beat France, they can share the championship.